Hey guys, welcome back. You know that on this channel, I mainly talk about how you can turn coding into money. I've done this multiple times myself, but today I want to share with you the story of how I just recently landed my first five-figure client. Making a few dollars here and there is one thing, but once you really understand the solid business model, like the one I will show you here, big opportunities like this start to appear. So I'll break down everything I did step by step and by the end of this video you'll have a framework you can follow to do the same. One morning a few weeks ago I checked my emails like I usually do and spotted one from a restaurant chain owner. He runs three restaurants in the states and he was in the middle of scaling his business online. He already had a website, delivery integrations, the usual deal, but he had one big headache, the variability of ingredient costs. Prices were changing daily, suppliers were in consistent and his menu margins were all over the place. He told me, I just need a way to know in real time how much every dish is actually costing me. Which, thinking back now, makes perfect sense. This problem, which on a spreadsheet might have been a nightmare, coding-wise was not really that hard to solve. A simple API that connects to supplier data, fetches daily ingredient prices, and calculates the true cost of every menu item was the most simplistic approach I could think of. Basically, every day my client would be able to open his dashboard and instantly see, hey, burgers went up 7% in price today, maybe I should adjust the menu or swap suppliers. Sounds small, but this kind of insight literally saves him thousands of dollars a month, which is why when I showed him the working demo, he didn't even blink at the 5-figure price I quoted, he just said send me the invoice. And I think this is the main reason building and selling APIs is so powerful. You're not just writing code, but creating something that solves a real business pain. And when you do that, businesses don't see it as an expense, they see it as a money saver and are willing to invest. While I was in the middle of building this, one of the students from my course messaged me. He just made his first API sale using the exact framework I teach and said he'd love to help if I had any projects coming up. We jumped on Cursor together, paired up and in a few days we had the whole thing built, tested and deployed. Watching a student go from zero to making real income and then partnering up with me on a paid project that was surreal. This project alone paid several thousand dollars up front with a monthly maintenance retainer on top, all for something we built in under a week. And that's what I keep telling people. If you're a developer, you already have everything you need to start doing this. APIs are pure leverage. You build them once and they can keep generating income for months or years. You just need to find small but valuable problems, turn them into clean usable endpoints and list or sell them directly to the people who need them. Now if you're curious how I pick ideas like this, how I find clients or even how I structure the APIs so they basically sell themselves, that's exactly what I teach in my course. It covers everything from the fundamentals of APIs to pricing, hosting and finding your first buyers. There's also a free section in there so you can test the waters. I'll link it right at the top of the description down below. In short, that's the story of how I built and sold another API. Simple idea, real business value and a great payout. If you take anything away from this video, let it be this. You don't need to build the next Instagram. You just need to build something useful that saves people time or money. That's where the real opportunities are. And there are already tons of developers proving this works. Take Irvin Rucci, the guy behind geocode.xyz. Basically a simple location API. Nothing groundbreaking. There are dozens of similar APIs out there. Well, according to Starter Story, Irvin makes between fifteen and thirty thousand dollars every month from that one API. Thirty thousand dollars. So when you see examples like that, you realize this isn't some rare once-in-a-lifetime success story. Every day, more developers are turning small ideas into real income, and they are no different than you. So what's stopping you from being next? Anyway, I hope this story gives you a bit of inspiration. If you've got an idea for an API or you are thinking about getting started, drop it in the comments down below. I read every one of them. Thanks again for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Until then, happy coding!